Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded, Alien Dawn. We left last episode trying to decide if Edmund or Simon were going to leave this episode or to send the ship off empty, the rescue pod. Well, while we were away, they had their own little meeting and they decided if there was a chance for one of them to get off this planet, then they were taking it. So... That's not up to us to decide, apparently. They want out of here. So, Edmund, let's draft you. You're you're up the mountain, right? Yeah, you're up there. So if you get here in time, then you can go. Draft, go there. And Rita, you're far away. You're cleared down over there in the fields. I don't know if you're going to get here in time or not. We've got, well, one hour but this one hour may be just about finished, so we'll see how this goes. Um, yeah, let's get everybody here. So draft, Carter over there, Simon over here, and start that running, and Prince, there you are. Let's get you in here to say goodbye as well. And hopefully Rita gets here in time, and hopefully Edmund gets here in time. No cute research. One hour left, we'll hit zero, and then a few more seconds later, it's going to launch. Oh, here comes Rita, good. So everyone's going to get here in time, we'll see if... Ah, Edmund made it, he made it. Zero hour, oh, it's close. Okay, so Edmund, let's undraft you and drop your sniper and drop your spear. Okay. And I think it's time to say goodbye to Edmund. He was our first uh, walk-in. Our four were there with Paulette, and Edmund just kind of walked in one night and said, Hi, guys. And just by chance was Carter's son. So farewell, fellow survivors. And he's out of there. All right, we're down to three. We got a lot of work ahead of us. All right, no more scavenging, Carter. You got work to do. Okay, so undraft everybody. Prince, you too this time. Forgot, forgot Prince last time. He just kind of uh, figured it out on his own. Otherwise, getting something to eat, petting an orphan, and getting something to eat. So Rita has a lot of this to, to uh, harvest. She doesn't have to do this, so she could do some. Beyond that, there's nothing else queued up. This is not harvesting, it's cutting. So that's more of a uh, carter job. So once she finishes these and those few berries, then we're going to set her mostly to cooking and try to catch up on some meals. Now, Ing wrote in and suggested that, since we're going to go to the trouble of doing this, this uh, outer fence here, which... Most likely the enemy bugs are not going to break through. Then we really don't need to have this inner fence, which has a lot of building materials if you if you think of it. So we could, hmm, and then we can turn these guys properly so that they're aimed out. Or we could maybe we'll see how this works. Tower the carbon towers uh, rotate like so. They won't. They will. They'll just kind of build right into the fences there. Which I think would look really good. Now, hit point-wise, that would take the place of two fences. It's 2,000 hit points right there. Versus one of these guys. 1,000 hit points. So that could be a weak point if they tear this thing down. We, will, we won't use them unless they camp themselves right here and start banging on the wall and we have no choice but to use them kind of like that idea too let's let's see i can i can let these guys run cancel these wooden ones that way they can lean out and shoot down the length a little bit better i think that would be better now do we need this here then uh yeah I, well not really not really no cancel you and like, let's cancel you as well and see if we can... You got some materials. See if we can make these guys uh, blend in a little bit better. 
Going from there to there. Nope, it's going to set the post wherever it wants to anyway. Okay. Alright, so we need to supply materials to that. Which... Hmm. Until this is finished, unfortunately, I can't really tear any of this out to grab the materials out of there. Okay. So Simon and Carter are both getting the uh, getting their their relaxation up. How are we doing, by the way? We are we badly need rest. Uh, who also needed a spear? Simon does. Okay, so Simon can go pick up that spear. I should have thought of that before they uh, before they left. He could have equipped this on the way. And someone else needs to bring this in. Yeah. Okay. So they're off to bed. And we're down to three. Boy, thunder's rolling in. It's three in the morning. Thunderstorm. I'm used to Edmund being up by now. Getting, being able to give him some assignments and getting to work. Hmm. So, Edmund dropped that material right here. It was 40. Okay, well, it wasn't 10, but... Yeah. Still, he should have brought home 150 at least. 160 is what he carried. Okay, so they're sleeping. They're going to sleep through a lot of this thunderstorm, which is probably good. Now, Rita could work tomorrow in, in, in the field. Carter, he's got things to do. Simon has got things to do, so there's stuff to give them uh, and plenty of, of distractions while we're waiting for the lightning to pass. So, unfortunately, I, well, I guess I could place those even now. Defense, because it's a half a step out. So from here. We could shoot down the length. They've got they'd have the range to cover all of this. So from there versus there, which would be more protected. This does look like a uh, you know something that would be a target. But you don't quite have the line of sight to shoot outside of the big fence from there. So I think it's gonna have to be here. So let's pop you into there. Uh, copy. And let's just do one more. Something like over here, which may as well do it where there's where it's not built yet. Okay, so did that drop the materials on the ground? Yeah, there's 22 on the ground now. So what happens here? We've got to tear that out. It's, it's red. Okay. So with that, we have Rita harvesting that. Rita, you're in decent enough shape. Let's harvest these. And let's send you down to Harvest Green. Carter is sleeping. Eh, we'll let him go a little bit longer. Get to seven. Simon, what you up to? You are tailoring. Alright, so... Your shirt is pretty much trashed. And tailoring, we have two in stock. Okay. Let's change this order so this doesn't accidentally extend further to a one time. So when you finish this one time, the one you're working on now, that should be it. And let me just reach on that. Okay. You're going to continue? Or did I just... Good, you're going to continue. So when that's done, you're done. Perfect. So Rita's out there. There's plenty of lightning rods to protect her there. Carter, it's time for you to get up. You need food? You could use... Well, you could use some food a little bit later. You know, a meal gives them more than 50% on this bar. So let's have you work on constructing these guys. And get those built. And once the storm's done, we can go grab the... Uh, the carbon nanotubes that Edmund had brought most of the way back home. What was that? It was a Pankoff landing. Yep. This planet's parrots. That's what they, they remind me of. Some are quite colorful. 
And then, Simon, when you're done, which is actually not going to be that long, come in and make one run of hauling in the grain. Then you can grab something to eat. So Carter's going to pop these in real quick. And he's going to do that quick enough. Let's just assign him to go ahead and get these guys built next. And that'll be finished. So what's it take to... Well, we are officially sealed in. With this here, then they cannot get inside even though this isn't built yet. Two taps. Three. Okay, so that's done. You're going to grab some logs from somewhere. Oh, right here. You need two more than that. Good. <laughs> I was thinking, dude, you, you do know you need seven, right? He does. Okay, he's got to figure it figured out. Okay, so Rita is probably about time to... Yeah, let's have Rita haul this in and grab something to eat. Carter, you are here. Okay. So, let's have Rita make one round of meals. So she needs to eat... Um... Let's first make meat pie. Then if I think of it, I'll have her eat one and then have her make breads. It was meat pie, meat pie, and bread. So just two recipes now. We'll keep these guys as happy as can be right to the end. So I have her drop that off, make... Whoa! That was close, yeah. Take a look at that thing, huh? Wow. Did we get this built? We did not. So we're not getting the advantage of pulling power into that, unfortunately. Uh, Carter, you could maybe put that together right now, right? It'd be a while before your, your fresh bread is baked. So sure, we can do that. So Simon is dropping off grain over in here now. Good. And you're going to transport an electronic. Actually, Simon, why don't you equip this and then haul that? Why don't you do, make that happen? So Carter's going to go find the alloy we have stored, which pretty much depletes us. So Simon, you're going to need to start making alloy pretty much the rest of the day. Did you finish the shirt? Is that considered done? It is done. Great. So we've got our two Draka now. We've got our three Olfen and a pregnant mommy. So there'll be a fourth one soon. Then we've got to decide if we're going to start eating. We don't need to eat Draka. We have our uh, um, Olfen. We have so much meat. So we're just we're just going to feed them. <laughs> Yeah, great big pets. Um, well, you, that wasn't what I intended, guys. It meant for you to eat something really good, but... Okay, we'll do it. Yeah, Carter's going to have your meat pie. Yeah, oh well. So, Rita, when you're done, let's cook some bread. Then, we'll let you back onto your normal schedule and probably go back and... Well, you'll go back and work on these. We don't really need those. So... I think I'll tell you specifically, come on out and finish the uh, the, the grain, gr harvesting the grain fields. Okay, so with that, Simon, you are transporting miscellaneous stuffs. Let's have you transport these, and hopefully that takes you to... Nope, Carter's already got it done. He does. Battery's finished. Okay, hey, you're just going to put these on the shelf. Um, so Carter's going to construct a fortification. So this probably takes priority over the fences. It must. So Simon... Boy. I'll have Carter go get that stack of 40. 
Simon, you need to get to work on these guys. So you're doing that, and then, yeah, you need to just get started. So, ore from al alloy from ore. That's what I'm trying to say. And I don't know how much is in stock. we still got some. Okay. There is still some up there. In fact, I had to uh, ban it or you know forbid it to keep them from running up there just to get 20 here and 20 there so I've got to go find all that again and probably walk Simon through a circuit to pick all of them up in the same trip somehow so Carter is constructing a fortification and yeah, grabbing those I wish I could use these materials to finish this up but it just doesn't work that way it'll open us up that'll be the easiest route in and the they won't track through the, through here anymore. Oh, the meat. Yeah. Hate to say it, but that's just buzzard food right now. We we don't have room in the freezer anymore. Well, we could. It's just not worth the labor. We'll never eat that much meat. Interesting. Constructing fortifications. So I guess. These are called fortifications, whereas this guy is called a tower. Ah, okay. So you are on your way up to those 40. Okay. You do that. Simon, is there time? There might be time. Let's... Where are you going? We have ore in here? We do. Okay. Let's get just this one done. And then let's get you up to get another run. Hopefully you'll bring 130 and not just enough to finish this last little bit. Carter? Oh, you went that way to get the 40, okay. Okay, so Simon, let's try it. Race up here. Grab these. Let's make sure you're in a place where you will grab... Um, where we have access to a whole 130 and it's not just that the other ones are too far away in case I'm not there to babysit you okay Rita is harvesting Prince is guarding where oh Carter is hauling there he is okay Otherwise, yeah, the remnants of that last battle. Well, those missiles are, are powerful. Can blow an Olfen off its feet. Pack quite a punch. Okay, whereas last episode was way too exciting, this one seems to be uh, coming off quite uh, quiet. Yeah, I think I will try to start running the game at a faster speed through these last few days. Maybe we'll go ahead and do three days per episode, or you know, call it by ear. Maybe different each time, but yeah, it's it's with just three of them now. There's just not a lot happening at the moment, so move time forward. Dropping off those 40. Simon, you're here. You have 100 only. Can I get you to bring more? Let's try it. Simon, haul this too. Now what do you do? Do you drop it? You ignored me. <laughs> I was on Simon too. Now, he has exactly a space for 100 and that's all he's going to bring two towers worth yep okay that's the game we're gonna play now these aggressive animals yeah so I've got to make sure Carter does not start to build this one or he will first thing bust a hole through this fence line now this doesn't count as no it's I'm pretty sure it's still there well, I can see through that fence. Well, even so, this is still contiguous. 
So no matter what's happening out here, we're still locked in. Okay. Now we've got the big ones here. These are the Shriekers. These are the... They're not the the biggest ones. These are the, the normal adult ones. Not the... Oh, what would you call those? Give me another nest. Uh, not that nest, but this one. The biggest ones were called nesting shriekers. Okay, these are just the the little guys. No, these are all shrieker or nesting hatchlings. So where's our middle ones? You nesting? Huh? Just a shrieker. So there must be three different levels. Three different uh, ages. And those are the middle ones. Okay. These guys are spooky. These guys have the tails that shoot spikes. So they're actually going to... Uh, they've got the potential of doing some serious damage. So let's make sure everybody is where they need to be. Simon? What'd you do? <laughs> Somewhere in here, Simon dropped his hundred and said, I need to go pet a dog. Okay. Ooh, we got this hiding in here. Okay. Yep. They do have a mind of their own. All right, well, you're not going back. Not with a nest of shriekers out here. Yeah. We... I don't know that we've actually had any of these come in with an attack before. We've definitely never had a dedicated one before. Oh, when was that? 22, maybe? So, 4 a.m.? which case, I think I need you guys to get to sleep almost immediately. Yeah, this is going to go by a lot faster also because we're on a faster speed. So you are... Let's just go straight for rest. Rita, why don't you go to bed? And Carter, uh, same thing. As soon as you're done, you're almost done with that. Go to bed. Simon is out here petting an orphan. Let's just work on getting you some, some rest. So if there's time afterward, we'll do some relaxation stuff. But Prince is already asleep anyway. Kurt is eating. He found his fresh bread. Okay. Now, these guys get any closer, or this guy here. Where'd the Draka go that's <clears throat> been hanging around? I don't know where he went. He's been hovering in here for the last uh, several days, but he seems to be gone now. Okay. So where are we? Two in the morning. At three in the morning, I'm going to send them in. I'm pretty sure it's four that it starts, but I want to make sure that they are going to, to the space over here. Yeah. Nope, it's 3 a.m. Okay. So, Carter, what do we do? We still have a stun gun. Yeah. So, I'm thinking that's over here. Simon, you're drafting head into here. And let's... Hmm. So, we have the same problem over here as here. If they shoot through and start picking them off as they're coming down... So since we're pretty well blocked over here, I'm going to set Carter and Rita to this end so they can't reach over there. At least I don't think they can. All right, you guys up? You're up. Okay. You're coming in. What are you guys doing? You're going to walk nice and slow. That's good. And... Everybody track this way. Be nice if they all came in a nice single file line and just head right into our traps. <laughs> Which we didn't reset. 
no, a lot of them are not reset. Gonna have to get out here and do this. In fact, for that matter, let's do that. Rita. Uh, try that again. Rita. Undraft. And handle 10 traps. Carter. Undraft. Handle 10 traps. Simon. Undraft. And handle 10 traps. Go, 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 go. Daylight starting up. Good. They'll be able to see to shoot. Yeah, these guys do go in quite slow. That's probably good. I'm just curious to see if they're going to branch right here and hit both directions. Alright, so how close are we? Simon's getting something to eat. No, 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 no. So Simon, get back in, handle traps, and when you're done, handle some more traps. Gotta babysit these guys sometimes. All right, Rita, handle some more traps, please. Carter, handle some more traps, please. Okay, Carter, you can handle these traps reserved by Simon. Simon, you are drafted. You're not getting away, and you're going up here. All right, where are we at? We have made it to here, and we are not splitting off, except for right here. You guys are not sure what you want to do. What's the eight? Bricks, okay. All right, so with that, now let's give up, call it good. Rita, draft, go here. Carter, draft, go here. All right, so can you guys get a line of sight on these? Now these are pretty low beasts, unlike the Junos, which were quite tall. But yeah, there's no line of sight anymore. You can't do anything till you get to here, okay. And I need to remember to have them turn... Actually, do we need to turn these off now? Except for the new battery, we're pretty well filled up. That lightning storm really helped. Alright, damage carbon fence. Oh, you guys are going through... Oh, Prince! Prince! Draft. Get in here. I know I... They killed Prince. <sighs> okay. Yeah. These guys are a, a whole different level of, of attack. Prince is... Uh, pets in this game are not a good thing. It, it just, it's just not. This game gets a little too real sometimes. Now, what's going to happen here? Are you going to give up trying to go through? 200 left. I think it was just Prince. I think after that, they're going to give up and turn. We'll see. All right, we're coming around the corner here. We should be triggering our, our radar. Boom. And they can shoot through. This is acting as a whole. Oh, great. If I pull this out of here, does it still? It took it out on me. Oh, it did. Okay, that's a problem. That's a really big problem. You two. Uh, there, there. I need you to stand down. Head over here. Do not shoot through that fence. I need the rest of them to track through. Yes, track through. Don't do it. Okay, what do I do with you guys instead? Um, because you've got quite a range. You're still going to be able to shoot through that. So, I think for the moment, what? I can put you down in here. You can still get 
a shot off over here. That's Rita and Carter. Lightning rod damage, yeah, they're, they're over there beating up this guy. But are they still working on the fence? 177, they're still trying. I'm waiting for him to give up and turn. Or at the very least, he'll be the very last one. And maybe won't. Okay, Simon does not have that kind of range, so he's fine. These guys do, but I don't think they have a line of sight any... Well, they almost do. I can't go any lower. I'm trying to see if they could see up through there or not. They can. Okay, Carter, you're helping too much, dude. I mean, you're you're one shot killing them. That's 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 good. But the one time you miss. Okay, so let's just wait here. There's our closest targets now. Will you? Good. Now you're sighting in over there. Perfect. So you guys do that. Oh, missiles. All of our missiles are are uh, set up for Olfen. Okay, target. There. There. And... This one? Yeah. I guess there. Okay. Now we'll see if this makes a difference. Boom. Yeah, that's more like it. Anybody turning into here? No. So now I can get you guys back to where you're uh, going to do some some uh, going to do a better job. Let's get you. Let's get you up to here. All right. So what's happening here? Are we turning to attack the fence? We are. Though so we're in pretty good shape there. These guys are all making their path through here. They're not tracking this way. Good. And you finally gave up. Though you two are... So you're still attacking something. You're trying to take this out. Aren't you? Yep. Alright. Ooh, we're actually getting a little low here. Okay. Now... Can they actually reach us from, say, this path right here with their tails? Boy, those rockets are something else. Destroyed lightning rod, that's fine. Boom. Now, we're not hitting them and flipping them out like before. So I guess it's just not as direct of a hit. Okay. So what's happening down here? We had three that were trying to alter the course of the war. They've given up. I'm waiting for you to give up now. You want desperately to take that down. You've given up on this one. And that was never hit. So it's just a matter of banging on this for a while and giving up. Okay. You want desperately to take out what? You going for these fences? No. What you shooting at? You're taking out this. You really want to take out our drying rack. Just to be... Little boogers. Okay. Well, we'll booger you over here. A lot of deflectants going on. Spaceship detected. Meaning their shells can deflect a lot of the damage, apparently. Alright, four left. I need... You guys can kind of do your thing. Let's get you guys, all three of you, up onto the porch here and see what you've got. So... Center you right there and see what happens. Because I have a feeling if I put you in here, you might be targets? I don't know. Let's find out. Carter, what if you were to go here? And Rita, you were to go here. 
And... Yeah, I've got nowhere to put Simon that's going to do any good. So, Rita and Carter can both one-shot. Oh, we're going to run right through the, the attack field here. Oh, you... No, nope, you didn't change your damage wind turbine. Okay. Climb up. And do you have a shot? Oh. <laughs> you hit Carter. We're going to take you down. Okay, you're down. Carter took an injury. Rita can reach. Deflected the bullet. Down and miss. Cover. And down. We got one left. You are turning the corner. And you're going to get nuked in that regard. Okay. Oh, Simon never even left. Okay. I don't know what happened there. but All right. So we're down to the one. We're down to the one. Yeah. And yeah. Lost Prince. I just assumed he would be safe in here, but yeah, they do have projectile that can go over these guys. Yeah, darn. Carter, under after you guys. Bleeding, not life-threatening. You go do what you need to do. <sighs> well, that is too bad. And unfortunately, I can't do anything with him. I still can't bury. Yeah, we, we set up an honorary grave back here for for dog and I guess we'll set up another honorary grave for Prince but not that I want to copy grave so I can't copy you can't copy all right um, where would that be camp grave we'll do that as well and just to get him off the map, I may have to to butcher just to just to make that happen, so it doesn't last the whole rest of the series. Him laying there. Otherwise, these guys are good for 15 meets, and I need somebody to go and talk to a spaceship. So that was a rough battle. Once this is all done, we're vulnerable anywhere we have the short fence from those guys. Now I think that's pretty obvious. Okay. Uh, 43 alloys at the moment. So Rita is eating. And then Rita needs to... Actually, she needs to heal Carter as soon as... Well, Simon. Whoever's done eating first. So Simon, when you're done, go over and heal Carter. And then Rita, you need to... Wow, your happiness is all the way at the bottom. Well, you get your food up. That will help. Then you need to play some music. And then you need to cook bread. And you need to cook meat pie. Okay, so Simon, you're going to do all that. Then you really need to go back and get those carbon nanotubes that you didn't complete bringing home. Yeah. Painful scar mistreatment. Ooh. Because it was... Edmund and Paulette that had the skills. Um, minor pain. So, here's what happens if you don't have a skilled illness, Carter. He's, now he's now he's got uh, an infection. Yeah, poor Carter. So, health. He infection mild on the left arm, painful scar in the right arm, and he's got his dementia. And immunity from pneumonia. So, Simon, I guess, continue. Already doing it. Yeah, healing Carter. Okay. Darn. Okay, so those need to get built, but they're not going to be protection against uh, against those... Uh, what do we call these guys? Shriekers. Yeah. So these need to get finished. And we need to probably continue wrapping this around to hear, to, at least to hear. Probably so. Because they're going to want to attack this. So we got to get them to a point to where by attacking it, they're in line, line of sight of 
defense weapons. Okay. So Simon is loading these up to be repaired. Let's see what he does naturally. He's transporting bricks. Oh, because he's got something to repair? Now you're just transporting. Well, okay, it's just this one group. All right. I want to see what he... Actually, you're heading in a weird pathway. No, you're dropping off. Okay. I want him to get back up and get those things, but he also has a good... Oh, he never... That's right, I need him to do this. Uh, we're halfway through. Simon, do this. Contact the ship. And then I need to figure out where you dropped that. I have no way of saying go get some. So where did you put 100 carbon nanotubes? Yeah. This is going to be a fun... Uh, there they are. Right. There. Okay. So Simon, you need... Actually, your food is fine. So I think you can pull this off. Haul those next. Transport. You have another handle in, in your list. I don't know what that is. Oh, what did I just have you do? I had you handle that. Okay. Oh. Handle means turn it off. Waiting to be turned off. So which one are we going to do? We're going to do that. I guess we're going to leave these running. Where, where am I? Right there. Yeah, let's leave these running. So that probably wiped out your order. You are handling orbital radio, so hopefully that means answer. We'll see. So I had these set to be turned off, then we never got around to it. So are you going to actually contact? Good. Okay. So you're doing that, Carter. You are convalescing. What does that actually mean? Your happiness is fine. You could use a meal, and then I need you back to work. You can limp along and get it, get the work done. So, do we have bread? This is where it should go. So you, Carter, eat. Yeah, it's so hard to see the bottom of that list. Won't let me. Okay, this one. Eat bread. Right there. Um, actually, do it right now. You will recover forever. Okay, so Rita's going to go work on this stove over here. All right. All right, so we've got an offer of supplies. Power cells, CPU cores, and electronics. I think electronics is always going to be where we're needing help. Because those get used up quite quickly. All right, six electronics coming in. Great. Devices destroyed, and we lost prints. A lot of red up there. Ignore that one. So Simon is transporting. Right. And Carter eating. And then what? Let's get this guy going first. And then let's just continue construction and then we're going to have to I guess we can't repair till we have some nanotubes in stock okay let's get you reloaded so construct you no copy you right there now Simon you didn't do it Simon <laughs> here One hundred. Simon, let's go get it. There you go. Hopefully you bring all one hundred. Okay, repairing or working on that. You're gonna go work on these. I need you just to go from repair job to repair job and get us all back together again. not quite sure how that works. Uh, I'm assuming we dropped 10 on the ground, 20 on the ground, when we lost these fences, but I guess you already grabbed them to load up other things. 
you are constructing fortifications. So do we have some in stock? I didn't think we did. Where are you going? You are off to go get more. And what does that mean? You're off to make the whole run. All right, well, in that case, Simon, you do, you're going to do it so much faster. You go and make the run, but I need to know where the other one is. Right there. So, Simon, you're going to do this. Carter, you're going to do... You instantly reprogrammed. Okay, you're grabbing the 100... Simon is grabbing, hopefully, 130. We'll see just how that works out. Okay, read up. What you have to do? You are harvesting again. We have meal-wise, one bread and two meat pies. So we've got one day's worth of food. Uh, click away. There we go. So, if we're going to do that, then get down and do the... Oh, you did the important one. Let's grab the watermelons. Okay. Do that one. And then we'll get Simon to haul all these in. Yeah. It's going to be tough with only three, and it's going to be even tougher with only two. And what is the noise? I guess that's wind. Kind of a low roaring noise going on. We'll do without this one for a while. In fact, do we even need to continue? We really don't. Let's just dump that one. Okay, that's gone. That's one job that's not necessary. Okay, Simon. You're up here. You're grabbing only 100 again. Carter, did you get the whole 100? Oh, oh good. We're still going to find out. I didn't want you to get up here and say, Well, I only need 10 for the job I'm working on. But, oh, so... Simon is grabbing for the job that you're working on. The original 100. He's still trying to get the two towers going. Apparently that's programmed to be the very highest priority. So we'll sit here and listen to the Pankoths scream in the trees. Wow. We're waiting for Carter to, to show up and show us that he can carry 100. Please do it. I don't want to fight you. Oh, thank you. Okay. They're going to work on that. Carter's in decent shape. Simon's not. So, hopefully he outpaces Carter and gets here as quick as possible. Then we'll have to give him some time off. Okay, so back to two speed, which I'm going to have a really hard time remembering. Animal flu. Okay, well, we... Transporting? And healing. Let's just get these done so this doesn't come up anymore. Okay, you grab all those, then you'll get the order to go give some antibiotics. Which we still have a, a whole lot of, right? Antibiotics, that's here? Medicines, yeah, 91 of them. Okay, we're fine. Meltdown Simon, a risk of. So... That's why it's feels way too fast. Okay. So you're healing. Simon is getting close. I think I'll leave him right there. We now know where those are. And he can go in a lot faster when he's not uh, hauling something. Carter? Too bad you can't also haul these. Can you? Carter? Haul. Nope, you won't do it. Absolutely will not do it. So Simon is making his way in before he breaks. He's going to grab his favorite food. And he's going to be just fine. Yeah, there we go. This should go away by itself, right? Well, there's no more risk of meltdown. Which isn't yet. There it goes. And did not go away. Okay. So Simon's going to sleep. I'm going to leave him alone. Rita, sleep. Carter, he's going to drop off the supplies to work on tomorrow. And he needs relaxation real bad. It's 2 in the morning. See if he does that on his own. About time we got another group of uh, angry animals. Angry at our 
and our antennas. Alright, you've done that. You're going to grab something to eat. You're... We'll send you to bed first. Or else you won't get the, the, the cue to go to bed. And dawn will happen and you'll just go off and start working again. And I won't realize it until you break. Yep, here comes dawn already. So you sleep, then you can relax afterward. Sleeping? Yep. Okay. Rot it away, about to rot away. Let's go turn those off. Of course, it's always a challenge. Can I find them this way? I cannot. So, rot head. That's not in this field. That's... Where am I? It's here? Over here. All these guys, if I turn them off... Will they stop telling me that they rotted? I don't know. They are... Yeah, one-fourth shelf life left. We're, in fact, if I turn those off, does that still count? I'm curious. So 1937, if I say use... 1987. 1937. Oh, I'm only dealing with 50. So yeah, it does take him out of the uh, out of the list. That was here. Yeah. So bush fruits. Turn all those off. We're not going to use them. Okay. Seventeen now. Okay. So that seventeen should be in our fridge. And that is way more, and down here. That's way more than we will ever use. Okay, they're starting to get up. They all want to go visit an animal. and I wonder if they get more than a plus 18 if they do that. Because most of the, the typical things, like playing music, is a plus 18. Yet they really crave being with the animals. Is that a huge bonus? Bonded with an Olfen. And that hangs around for a while, right? That hangs around permanently. Okay, so we definitely want to see more of that. Slept in a comfy bed. Alright, who's going to finish first here so I can see what what happens? Uh, Rita. Watched an animal. That it? Interested in farming, playing music. Watched an animal is only a plus ten. Huh. Carter would get a lot more, which he needs, if he would just go play an instrument. So, Carter, you got washed an animal for 10. Okay. Anyway, Carter's going to go repair a fence. He's going to grab the 100. Hopefully, he really grabs the 100. Otherwise, I'll have to set him up just to haul it. He might repair a fence for five and say that's good enough. Grab all of it. Thank you. All right, Simon, you are transporting. That's not critical. So once you're done with that, uh, Rita, I'd say that's not critical too. So let's have Rita get back to cook buttermelon pie, sure, and cook bread. After you're done with the amount of harvesting that was already in your queue. That's fine. So Simon, I need you to go do things that are more important. What does that mean? That means more of these guys. So you... Really, you need something to eat. Is there any pie hiding in here? Uh, Simon... Nope. Nope. So it's all been eaten. Alright. Then how about you just grab some bush fruit. Then let's see if we can't get you back up and get another load of these guys brought in. So what do we got left? We have a 70 there. Let's try for this 70. Let's see if you can go either direction to get more. 
At the very least, it should be enough to finish the job. Carter is dropping off all kinds of stuff. So by the time that that Simon gets up there, he should be able to calculate everything else that's needed. Right? Carter said he was repairing. Nope, he is stocking. I need to know that he's going to hit these two for repairs. Everything but one. Oh, man. Oh, you got it. Oh, good. Oh, good, good, good. So that means there's nothing else for Simon to try to match up quantities to. Everything's filled. So he should bring back a whole 130. That's what I'm getting at. But I kind of want to make sure of that. That's a long trip to take. Can I turn that off? I can, okay. Long trip to make to only go get five. And I've seen them do that before. So, 20, 70, and 40. There's your 130. You just picked a really weird way to do it. Okay, Carter, you're getting them all built. Perfect. So, in that case, let's... Hmm, I want to tear these out. Let's go ahead and get these finished first. So, constructing a tower. Now, Carter, you need to construct these guys and construct that one. And let's see if that finishes this over here. Yeah. Then I need you to do this one. And then, I think we'll go ahead and tear down these guys and get them rebuilt. Yeah, so we should be fine. So pause, I want... Kind of hard to grab these sometimes. From there... To there. Grab all of the carbon fences. Deconstruct. And the... The gates will keep. So just the carbon fences. And carbon does... Or carbon... Carter does deconstruct. Before he does build or repair. So he should automatically go over and do this. Yes. He's just taken an odd pathway to get there. A really odd pathway. Dude, could you not have just walked through the gate? Oh, well. <laughs> Alright, as soon as you do that, boy's getting dark all of a sudden. Um, Carter? Yeah, let's 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 do this last one. Deconstruct. All right, so we want more of these guys. Uh, copy from here to there to there. And Carter, you can go a little longer without food. Let's see if it's possible to load these in. Grab all of the stuff laying on the ground. Yeah, 666. Six, six. So there's 18 sitting out here. No, you're only going to do two at a time. Alright, so I'm guessing that Simon is going to eventually get the order to go load all those in. Okay. So you're dropping that off. There you go. Now I want you to get your, uh, your pie. No, you've decided you're going to go do that. Draft on draft. We have something to eat. Good. And then when you're done, let's do a couple of housekeeping things. Get these two finished. Simon can deliver materials. He's after he's done bench pressing, and I assume eating. Yeah, get your happiness up a little bit. Carter, you as well. You get yours up by eating that buttermelon pie, and I think. We're going to call this day the last day of this episode. I have a feeling I'll be kind of playing these by ear. 
maybe three or four days some of these you know these these episodes because the days won't be that uh, exciting there might be other days when like the last episode when so much goes on that we're lucky to get uh, a couple of days in so Rita's transporting a bunch Carter's building those brought a more poo away Simon is eating Rita when you're done your fullness is fine let's have you drop oh you're gonna go no, you're gonna drop it off there. Let's have you make a meat pie and make a bread. And if you're starving, you'll ignore my orders and go and eat anyway. Simon went to bed. Simon, because it's one in the morning already. Yeah, okay. So in that case, maybe I should have uh, let Rita get some sleep. Carter's getting some sleep. Yeah, he's he's gonna be fine. We'll just have Rita do the the first one, then I'll cancel her. Once it gets to cooking, boy, she stirs that bowl fast. Wow. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't need an egg beater. All right, go on to sleep. And actually, I, I think I will too. So I'm going to call this one done here. Catch you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.